Now, we've all probably had what we think is a great idea yeah. for a brand new business, but rarely do we do anything about it. Why? Well, perhaps the cost or maybe the work involved, or maybe just we don't even know where to begin. Yeah, that's usually the problem, isn't it? Uh, our next guest, though, may have a few ideas. He helps to get new firms off the ground. But his background may not be what you expect. Jim Duffy was a police officer for 11 years. He was in Glasgow. Now, before launching his firm Entrepreneurial Spark in Scotland, the idea was to help entrepreneurs turn their business ideas into reality. Well, eSpark now has so-called hatcheries across the UK, from Glasgow to Belfast, Birmingham to Cardiff, and they look after firms until they're ready to stand on their own two feet. And it's now expanded into India in a fairly massive way as well, where we are joined by the man himself. Jim, thanks so much for coming in. Good morning. Nice to see you. Welcome. Um, let's just start, first of all, with what you do. Um, we've explained a little bit there, these so-called hatcheries. It's the idea of taking a, an idea for a company and an entrepreneur and giving them the support to get off the ground. Is, that, is it as simple as that? Yep. So we're, we de-risk them. So we've got an 18-month programme. We've got three hatcheries in Scotland. We're about to open 10 with NatWest and KPMG in the UK. We bring them into a space, there's no cost in the space, so the entrepreneur keeps all that equity. And we look at the mindsets and behaviours, we look at how they build teams, emotional intelligence, leadership, and through that 18 month programme, we make them investable, and it doesn't cost them a thing. During the 18 months, in terms of the money that they need, do you provide that funding that they need to, to get started? No. So they have to have the money to get started? They have to have the money to get started, but every entrepreneur thinks they need money. Actually, what they need is customers to get started and a better validated idea. So by providing them the premises, hatcheries are five to 7,000 square feet of physical space where they can grow their business and grow their team and work with entrepreneurial enablers and mentors and investors, they'll become investable. Uh, and at some point, at some point their business will grow, but we don't provide funding. What we've done in Scotland is absolutely amazing. We've created a thing called the Scottish Edge Fund. It's world class. John Swinney, our finance minister, created that. And with NatWest and KPMG, we've also created a £1 million fund. It's going to be the biggest world competition in the, and it's going to be in the UK next year. So basically those two organisations are providing the finance for this? Yes. And what do they get out of it then, I suppose is the question, that they get a, a first step, an option to get involved in that company early on and, uh, and they get the benefit then of seeing it grow, I imagine. So they're two huge behemoth companies, but what they'll get is they'll get trust, they'll get advocacy, there'll, there'll be a thousand, when we're at full pelt in two years' time, we'll have over a thousand start-up and early-stage ventures coming through these hatcheries. These are high-impact entrepreneurs, 21st century entrepreneurs, so we need to know what do they need, how are they thinking, how do they want to be financed, you've got the rise in equity crowdfunding, what are they looking for? and they'll grow together with these companies. It's almost like they're coming down and finding out what's the next generation needing and how can we tailor our services and products accordingly. And this will be happening in India in the near future as well? Yeah, we open our first with Viridian Group. We're going to open our first hatchery in Ahmedabad in Gujarat in August this year. We've currently got our two Indian enablers training in Glasgow right now. Really good to talk to you, Jim. Time is against us, unfortunately, but uh, really nice to uh, hear what you're up to. So Jim Duffy there, founder and chief exec of Entrepreneurial Spot. Thanks for coming in. Thanks.